Praise him upon the loud cymbals. Praise him upon the high sounding cymbals. Let everything that has breath praise the Lord. Mm. Praise ye the Lord. You know, praise the, praise the Lord Amen. Almighty. So what we're going to do now is we're going to, uh, we're going to sing. We're going to praise and just, you know, allow God to. You know what's amazing too, brother? What's that? The what's Lord, that? The word of God says that God inhabits the praises of his people. Amen. So if we start up with that, Ooh. God's going to inhabit. I, I, I believe that there are people who are out there who's, mm. who's needing to praise with us, brothers yes. and sisters. So if you're, if you're one of them and you know you, you, you're feeling kind of guilty, you're feeling depressed, you're feeling, I don't know what you're feeling or what you're, right. you're the word of God says praise mm. him. And mm -hmm. even in during your hard times, he says praise him. Right. This is the opportunity where you got Perry and me and Dexter who are here and we can praise together so that whatever you, you're, is burdening you or whatever is is holding you captive that God will set you free. Yes. Amen. So let Amen. us let us do this. Uh, let's uh, this is this is 10,000 10,000 reason. God is so good. Bless the Lord oh my soul. Oh, 
worship your holy name. Yes, Lord. Oh, I worship your holy name. Lord, I worship your holy name. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Jesus. Let's continue. Let's continue. You know, we got to continue to praise yeah. the Lord. This is goodness of God. Amen. Amen. Yes. Goodness of God. God been good to you, Perry? Oh, uh, all the time, bro. <laughs> Dexter, God been That's good to I'm you? Yes. Let's praise, oh. his, praise his name uh, on the radio. Jesus. Praise his name in friendship, in, in, in relationship, in everything. I love you, Lord. Oh, your mercy never fails me. Yes, Lord, never. Oh, my days have been held in your hands. From the moment that I wake up till I lay my head, I will sing of the goodness of oh God. Are we on beat right now? We are? Okay, let's go. All oh my life you have been faithful. Brothers, sing it. Oh, all my life you have been so, so good. Yes, Lord. With every breath that I am in, oh, I will sing of the goodness of God. Yes, Lord. Love your voice. Close like no other. Yeah. Hey, I know you as a father. I know you as a friend. I have been in the goodness of God. God. All my life you have been so, so, so good. good. My God, you're so good. Every breath that I have made, oh, you enable me. I will sing Hallelujah. for the goodness of God. God. Hey, let's go. Your goodness is running after, it's running after me. Your goodness is running after, it's running after me. When my life laid down, I'm surrendered now. I give you everything, Lord. Your goodness is running after, it's running after me. Your goodness is running after, it's running after me. Running after me. Your goodness is running after, is running after me. When my life's laid down, I'm surrendered now. I give you everything. Everything, Lord. Oh, your goodness is running after, is running after me. Oh, every day since we were born until now, into eternity, Father God, you are faithful and true. You have been faithful all my life, Lord Jesus. All my life, you have been so, so good. God, you're so good. Every breath that I am in, oh, I will sing of the goodness of God. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Thank you, Father, for this opportunity. Thank you for our... All my life you have been faithful. Yes, Lord. Yes, you are. All my life you have been so, so good. Every breath that I have been, you give me breath. Oh, I'm going to sing of the goodness. 
Him in the morning, praise Him in the evening, praise Him every single day. Uh, you know, what was that song that you were saying that we were to sing? Reckless love, you know, reckless love of God. Reckless love of God. It is in a storm; it'll come at you like a storm, like yes, hurricane or whatnot. This one. So, if this is going to be the, you know, it, it got me, you know. It's the, the lyrics that... The, this, is, this, this is the lyrics? The lyrics is important. Pay attention, important. To, the Pay attention to the lyrics. And, and let, let us, let Perry sing, yeah, yeah, yeah. worship. Coming after me. There's 
Snow shadow you won't light up, mountain you won't climb up, coming after me. Yes, Lord! There's no wall you won't kick down, lie you won't tear down, coming after me. Oh, the overwhelming, never ending, reckless love of God. But oh, we chase as we meet down, fight still. The the hey. But I couldn't earn it. Jesus, oh, I don't deserve it. You are the one. Still, you gave yourself you away. You gave your life to us, Lord. But oh, the Thank overwhelming, never-ending, reckless love of God. Yeah, yeah. amazing God. Break the chains of depression. Break the chains of anxiety. Break the chains of suicidal thoughts right now in Jesus' mighty name for you are. You are the one who already did it. Thank you, Jesus. You are the one who already did it. Thank you, Jesus. You are you are the faith, faithful one. You are, oh, yes, Lord. You are so amazing. Reckless love, Lord, today for everyone. Yes. What's that? Receive. You receive this Worship the, love of God. the reckless love of that God. Will not you know? stop at any that point to come at you, to come and <laughs> yank you from wherever you are. The darkness <laughs> that you're stuck in, yes. you know. Because I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. No matter what situation you find yourself in, yes. you know, God has has allowed us to be able to to truly function in the mm. ways that he has destined us to be able to. Amen. Meaning strength, wisdom, knowledge, uh, love, uh, what you call this, uh, uh, what else? What, what, what else? Uh, self-control. That's yeah. one of the most important things. Self-control. You know, the fruits of, of, of God. So the, I'm sorry if I'm going in and out of uh, like trying, like speaking Palawan and speaking English. Huh? Uh, it's just oh, that we gotta, know. we gotta really emphasize uh, the importance of, of the words and the, and the, the urgency of the gospel of God to be able to share. You know, it's not about 10 years from now and then and then something is going to happen, but it's about what are we doing now, Dexter? Yes. You know, you know, what are we like? That's the question that we have. To, we give thanks to God Amen. on Fridays or on, 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 on Sundays or the days that, you know, we, in our mind we say, okay, these are the times that or before we eat. Yes. The reality is that you walk, you talk, you breathe, yes. you, 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 you. <laughs> Uh, the, the you know the, the, the this show is called what? Uh, thank God. It's thank God it's Friday. Should be thank God it's every day. Every thank day. God it's a T G I E. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> T-G-I-E. Thank God T-G-I-E. it's every day. Uh, <laughs> yeah. You know. So uh, I'm gonna read from something that uh, I, I was reading this morning, and uh, mm. and uh, it's it's coming from Acts 16, uh, uh, verse 14, and I'm gonna read to to. Uh, Till uh, Acts 21, I believe. That's what it's going to go. So uh, there's uh, something that is important for all of us to take from this. Uh, even mm-hmm. me, I have to really understand. Mm. So it is written, uh, And a certain woman named Lydia, mm-hmm. a seller of purple of the city of Theatira, which worshipped God, heard us, whose heart, whose heart the Lord opened, that she attended unto the things which were spoken of Paul. And when she was baptized in her household, she besought us, saying, If ye have judged me to be faithful to the Lord, come into my house and abide there. And she constrained us. And it came to, uh, to pass, as we went to prayer, a certain damsel possessed with a spirit of divination met us, which brought her masters much gain by soothsaying. The same, the same followed Paul and us and cried saying these men are the servants of the most high God Mm. which shew unto us the way of salvation and this did she many days but Paul being grieved turned and said to the spirit I command thee in the name of Jesus Christ to come out of her and he came out the same hour and when her masters saw that the, the hope of their gains was gone they caught Paul and Silas and drew them into the marketplace unto the rulers, and brought them to the magistrates, saying, These men, being Jews, 
do exceedingly trouble our city and teach customs which are not lawful for us to receive, neither to observe, being Romans. And the multitude rose up together against them, and the magistrates rent off their clothes and commanded to beat them. And when they had laid many stripes upon them, they cast them into the prison, charging the jailer to keep them safely. So that ends at 23. Why am I sharing this? It's because, you know, it talks about uh, where uh, Paul goes and he's, he's uh, preaching and everything, and there's this uh, lady who, who's uh, divination. You know, what, we, what, we, what do we talk about divination? They're, they're fortune tellers. They're future tellers, right? Mm -hmm. and, and, and that lady followed, followed Paul and Silas to, to say, these are the men of God. These, they're showing the way. As they kept going for how many days, days and days on end, right. he, Paul turned around and was annoyed with her and said, to the spirit, be gone. Now the question is why? Why is, why is, uh, uh, why is uh, Paul getting annoyed with, with uh, this lady? Why? Why do you think? I'm, I'm gonna, not the spirit of God. It's not, of course, it's not the spirit of God. And why is the spirit of God uh, uh, the, the, the spirit that is not of God coming and, and, and saying uh, to the people that these men are, are the men of God to showing the way. You know, in that, in that scripture itself, a lot of times we try to figure. And so here's the thing that's happening in our, in our, in our midst. That lady who was walking with Paul and Silas, she was going because the crowd was being around Paul and Silas because there was there was healing and miracles and all these things that was happening and this lady who's who's earning money by telling the future and and the, and the fortune telling was including herself with the things of God yes, right. so she's mixing the things of this world with the things of God mm -hmm. they're both spiritual mm -hmm. and that's the part where we have challenges in our churches nowadays because now what's happening is People think that they can they can deal with the Holy Spirit in the in the in the church, and when they get out, then they go to the to this black magic that is is going around in our in our in our island. And and I'm I'm telling you, Perry, mm -hmm. people are going. People who go to church every Sunday, mm -hmm. when they get out and then they face the normal daily stuff, they are going to people who have who have. Uh, who, who, who's known in Palau that they're, they're, they're healers or, they're, or whatever that they're doing that is black magic. We call it because anything that is not of God is, is, is black. It comes from the kingdom of darkness. Yeah. So that's why I'm, I'm bringing this up is because the truth is we cannot, we cannot mix both. And that is why Paul, you know, Paul... Uh, 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 he, he what he, was that he what's that called what's that he he, he took he yes. cast out the demon from from that lady mm -hmm. so now the problem now how you know how you know things went uh, went uh, uh, it, uh, like went the other way for the people earning those money is that when they stopped earning money mm. they didn't have a problem with that lady following Paul and Silas until she could not do what she was doing because they were earning money with the crowd so you know why are we bringing this up because in these days these end end days in these 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 times that evil is showing itself in such a way that it's 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 you can see it in the many many programs that are going on mm -hmm. all we're saying is that you have to you have to really discern discern the spirit of god and we're here to praise the lord we're here to to give thanks to the lord we're here to to say, let's all come together and 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 be able to to allow God to do what He does best, which is, He brings peace, He mm -hmm. brings wisdom, He brings the ability for us to to pray for our leaders, pray for and to hear testimony. So so now, can, can I read this? Yes, go ahead, go ahead. This part uh, has a lot to do with what you're you're sharing. It says the. It's in uh, First Corinthians chapter two, verse six on, and it's titled "God's Wisdom Revealed by the Spirit." Okay. So, so we do, however, however, speak a message of wisdom, 
among the mature, but not the wisdom of this age or of the rulers of this age who are coming to nothing. No, we declare God's wisdom, a mystery that has been hidden and that God is destined for our glory before time began. None of the rulers of this age understood it. For if they had, they would have not crucified the Lord of glory. However, it is written, what no eyes has seen, what no ears has heard, and what no human man has conceived, the things God has prepared for those who love him. These are the things God has revealed to us by his spirit. God is good. Yeah, by his spirit, right? By his spirit. So you said that, you know, the spirit you know, helps us to discern. Amen. Which is the truth. In which, so the word of God also said, also says that we need to test the spirits. You know, Amen. If it's, uh, it also says that those who join with the Lord is one spirit. Amen. So we're supposed to. So the spirit searches all things, even the deep things of God. Amen. For who knows a person's thoughts except their own spirits within them. Amen. In the same way, no one knows the thoughts of God except the spirit of God. What we have received is not the spirit of the world, but the spirit who is from God so that we may understand what God has freely given us. This is what we speak, not in words taught us by human wisdom, but in words taught by the Spirit, explaining spiritual realities with spirit-taught spirit words. The person without the Spirit does not accept the things that come from the Spirit of God, but consider them foolishness and cannot understand them because they are discerned only through the Spirit. There we go again. There we go with the Spirit. Spirit of God. The person with the Spirit makes judgment about, about all things, but such a person is not subject to merely human judgment. For who has known the mind of God so as to instruct him? Amen. Well, we have the mind of Christ. Amen. Amen. So here's, the, here's, here's what, you know, we really need. We as Palauans, here's here where it comes to us as Palauans. We have to speak about the importance of understanding why did God create Palau, this land of Palau, and yeah. why did he create the Palauans in it Amen. with the culture and with the heart, exactly. you know, because the, yes, we as Palauans have mm. to understand, we have to have the heart for our young generation. Our what nation. are yeah. our, yeah, our nation, our young, our people? Our people. Mm. What's happening yeah. with us? Uh, are we losing who we are? Are we losing who we are in Christ? Right. Are we, what are we still respecting the elders? Are we helping one another? What are we doing? Yes, there's right. going to be uh, lots of things that a lot of our leaders are able to come in and put up programs and talk about laws and everything like that. Right. Those are good. I'm not mm -hmm. saying that it's bad, but what I'm, what I'm trying to share with everybody is that we must have the government of God. The words of God, the Constitution, yes. the, the, the Bible, the, the holy words of God, the living. The word of God is living and active and alive. Able, uh, it's, it's sharper than any two-edged sword, able to penetrate into the, into, to the, in, in the soul, to separate soul and spirit. Able to cut right through bone and marrow. Able to judge the, the thoughts and the, 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 thoughts and the, what, what, the plans of, of a man. These are the things that we have to talk of old and now because what our God's words, our Father in heaven, Amen. his words and his promises have not changed. And especially for us Palauans, mm. we have to start speaking boldly and praying boldly, meaning, what does it mean, brother? It means to have testimonies. It means to have worship. Yeah, it it means to, to go into the public and, 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 and just just rejoice and be able to speak of God freely and lovingly and uh, with, re with, uh, with, with, with rejoicing. Mm -hmm. So what we're going to do now, what we're going to do now, Brother Perry, we're going we're gonna to give uh, uh, my brother Dexter over here mm -hmm. to, to share his testimony about how important God was for him when he was, uh, when he was bedridden, when he was, mm -hmm. you know, because some of us, you know, we walk around with, with, with the, yeah, we walk with two feet. We were able to lift stuff, but yet we are held in, 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 in bondage of, of depression, anxiety, suicidal thoughts, mm -hmm. all these things that are holding us, holding us down to, to where the devil is laughing at us as Palauans. Mm -hmm. So we have this one man mm -hmm. who came from Saipan. His name is Dexter Daniel. He came because he wants to share, share his victory in Christ 
because him as a Palawan, he has a, he has a story to share with you guys to let you know how much God loves you. So Dexter, if you don't mind uh, sharing your testimony with people yes. who, was who are listening. And so, you know, we are here for, we, we are here to praise God. And so, you know, we are not perfect, but we came here to share the love of God that changed our life. And yes, I was bedridden because of ignorance, not, not to read the Bible and to seek the Lord. But I was using my, my own mentality that I need to work, I need to do this. But when I got sick and being bedridden, I, I find myself like in a, in a room with nobody else but me, That's a cool. darkness. And so, huh. and so when I went that, that place thinking that I'm useless, not able to get up, not able to, to go around or, or to even to help myself, feed myself, like, mm. like to cook my own food, I'm not able. So, you know, that mentality gave me a, a lost hope that I'm thinking that the only way to find peace is to suicide. Mm. And so, you know, I went to that part and I, I thinking that I'm still able to, because there's doctors that can help me, can help me to, to cure my, uh, my sickness. But when I went to the doctor and the doctor prescribed me a med medicine for me to drink, so when I finish, so to drink, so I, so I asked the doctor, if I finish these medications and my feet still pain, what am I going to do? Then the doctor said, I don't know. And that's the, that's the wall that I went, that I'm thinking. So if the doctor cannot help me, what I'm going to do next? Mm -hmm. And I was clueless, but I thank the Lord that he's always with me. But I, I didn't, I didn't know until I reached that part. And I'm not, I'm not praising the Lord that I reached that part. But it's the point that I need to realize that I am loved. I am, I am loved by God. And no one else can give me love more than God. And so when I got saved, I said, Lord, I want to serve you. It's because I was bedridden and I'm, I'm, and I, I be able to walk a little, and then I found Christ. Then from there, even though I found Christ, but my faith still, still beginning. So I'm, I'm trying to, trying to be able to, to seek Him wholeheartedly, because you know, God saved and God healed, but. You know, I need to exercise that faith to be able to truly, by his stripe, I am healed. And truly pull, root it in my heart that no matter what the, the enemy is telling me, there's healing, there's hope, and there's peace and joy in the Lord. And my, so uh, I'm here not my because Lord. of I, I was, I'm, I'm able to come here and talk. No, I come here to... To, to to share my my story that there's hope Amen. there's hope in Jesus Christ and so if you're thinking that there's there's no hope in you know I'm I'm sick and I'm this no I I cancel that in Jesus name and I tell you now that there's hope in Jesus Amen. even though you don't understand the Bible keep reading good times bad times keep reading the Bible because the Holy Spirit there to help you, there to teach you, there to guide you. And so when you keep on reading, you will be able, because when you ask, you shall be, be given. You, when you knock, the door will open. And when you seek, you shall find. And mm -hmm. that's the word of God. That is written. So when I start reading, reading the Bible, I be, I, I'm able to understand the Bible and those, those things that I didn't understand. And, and it's not, the, the Lord will not give you right away. But if it will be with you until you realize the answer that you, you, your walk will answer your own self that, you know, this is what the Lord is telling me, what the Lord is showing me. 
And so, you know. Until the truth sets you free. And until the <laughs> truth sets you free. The truth has you know, set you free. <laughs> yes. And, the, and you it. know, the reason why I'm do. here is because <laughs> the joy of the Lord is my strength. The joy yes. of the Lord. Nothing else. Woo. I cannot find I the like joy that, in brother. anywhere. I was in the in the world, but I couldn't find the joy that no one mm. can give me love wow. more than my Jesus Christ. My Jesus. My yeah. Jesus. Woo. My Jesus. Hey. You should sing that song. Okay. And so I wow. I thank the Lord of each wow. and every one that bring brother. us together. We are not we are not uh, accident or mistaken to be here. Yes. Each and every one. Do you, Do you know why? Do you know why? Because there's somebody out there that needs to hear this yeah. good news. Amen. Yes. And so if you think that oh you're one less or you say so what? No, I cancel that. And I said everybody know that he's for everyone. Yes, you he's for. for I love he my brother, me, my sister. He can save wow. you. He wow. can save you. And so let's us, come and share the testimony. Be able to to overcome the the the, the darkness. Attack, come and the darkness. Taste the yes. Come and taste yes. the goodness of God yes. that is so available for you because wow. He has died and He has risen and He is doing what we cannot do. Yes. And I'm I'm sharing this testimony. Why? It's because I already experienced it, experiencing Ooh, nice. it. I cannot explain something that I that I I, do I, I don't know. not know. Uh, yeah, so I cannot know. explain mm -hmm. what Brother Perry or Brother Jacob can 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 do on their life because I I don't know. But I'm explaining this because of the things that I went through and I understand and I feel it and I know it that there's hope in Jesus. Christ. Let's go. Let's go. Yes. Let's go. Amen. That's what I was talking Amen. about. Yeah. Who do you serve? Jesus. My King Jesus, the <laughs> Lord of all Lords, King of all kings. <laughs> you know, Perry, Ooh, you know, I Dexter, like I, lo I love your king. You know, one of the things is, and I'm going to also reemphasize what you just said. Mm. You know, if, if, if God saved Dexter, you know, f for a, a bigger picture and uh, purpose than he can understand, God saved me, and I can, I cannot tell what he went through, but I can tell you what I, I've been through. <laughs> a, a, a former a soldier, uh, a, a former governor, former drug dealer, from former uh, drug uh, addict, a former <laughs> drug smuggler, uh, alcoholic, uh, I, I mean, you, you name, name it, with you depression, it. suicidal, all that stuff. Yes. If God can put me here with you yes. and you, Perry, to be able to sing praises and to be joyful and to allow him to speak and say there is power in the name of yes, Jesus. Jesus. And it is he's the awesome truth, God. the way, and the life. Amen. It's something to really reconsider Amen. if if uh, 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 whatever, to really look uh, into. something to really look into. Huh? Yeah. So again, uh, we're going to sing one, uh, one more song right. and two, and then Perry's going to. Uh, uh, share a little bit about no, no, once enough, 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 enough. Okay, okay, okay. No, so no, no, here's uh, <laughs> the end of it. <laughs> <laughs> end of it. But, there, but uh, yeah, I, I'll share something. Okay, so let's. Uh, how about we sing uh, uh, Hosanna? You know that song? Mm. No. I thought you were gonna sing about my Jesus. Oh, my Jesus. Okay, Your let's. Jesus. My, Jesus. Jesus. Okay. <laughs> my Jesus. Okay. My Jesus. Okay. God is. Uh, so good. Yes. Yes. I'm sorry. Where which one? This one. Yeah. Uh, instrumental. Yes, sir. Okay. So if we're gonna play this one, it's gonna. So we don't own any rights to this music, music that we're gonna yes. we're gonna sing. Okay. Yeah, because this is uh, an actual. So uh, we we do not own any rights to it. Okay. So we praise God for those who. Yes. You know. So. I'm so sorry. I don't know. You guys said that one. What song is that? My Jesus. There you go. Yeah. The one with the lyrics. Let's play it. Okay. Okay. You know, God, thank you so much for leading the way. <laughs> Wherever you are, whatever you're doing, God, have your way. Are you past the point of leaving? Oh, that's not it. It's okay. That's his favorite song. Okay, so guys, okay, you you look for it. What? So you look for it. Look for the song that you're talking about. My Jesus, my Savior, 
No, there is none like you, my That's a good one too, but. And this is, you know, it's, see, that's the most amazing thing about it is that it's that nothing phases us. So I hope that you you understand that. Uh, be okay. There we go. God is good. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. us right now. Bless those who are listening. My Jesus, my Savior, Lord, there is none like you. Lord, I want to praise the wonders of your mighty love. My comfort, my shelter, Tower of refuge and strength. Every breath of all that I am never sees to worship you. That's very high. Huh? Hallelujah, Lord. The Lord of the earth, let us sing. Power and majesty. Praise to the King. Mountains bow down and the sea will roll at the sound of your name. I sing for joy at the work of your hand. Forever I love, forever I stay. Nothing compares to the promise I have. Compares to the promise I had. Oh, nothing compares to the promise I had in you. Yes, wow. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. So we're gonna continue. Nothing and compares. just before uh, Perry, uh, you know the importance of understanding that. Our young generation, you know, mm. they're born into what the society has already been structured, right? right? Mm. And so I just want to let everybody that, you know, from the young gen, this generation, I want you to question many things that are going on. Seek the Lord. Ask right. him whether the, the, the normal things that are you considering, like cussing and also like, you know, just spending time uh, doing things that are, what, what are you spending time doing? Uh, it, does it lead to glorifying God? Is it leading to bringing up our nation as Palawans to become better, stronger, wiser, respectful, loving? You know, uh, what are we doing as, as a generation? What, what, what are we doing? You know, so this is the reason why we come. We, we come to just uh, like 
ask questions and to allow God to to truly touch your heart right now. Know that we come with love and we come with uh, respect and honor. And we truly believe that we are messengers of God to be able to to look into look into what what's going on in our islands. And we know that there's challenges from drug use to 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 uh, divorces to to many things that are of the kingdom of God. So we ask that you pray and know that there's more to it than just what uh, we're. So what uh, more than more to it than what we're making normal of uh, in in our society. So right now I'm going to turn it to Perry to give a, a little. Uh, what, why why are you here, Perry? Well, just like everybody else, I was uh, young once and searching, wanting to know uh, who I yeah? wanted to be. From that question to. Why am I here? Yeah, why are you why here right now? What are, what, what's your purpose right what's, now? What is my life you know, yeah. for? And what is your life for? And from, I, I praise God because, you know, I, I, even though I started off a little bit later in life, you know, I'm proud of, of those that are younger that are in that search because mm. I tend to, I uh, kind of, you know, took a while for me to mm. finally came to that question where I, I had to question Everything that I had, you know, it wasn't amount to anything. Wh when was this, if you don't uh, mind me asking? Uh, when was in my prime time as a, you know, a young man uh, searching thing to, to make it. Uh, make uh, it big uh, in this uh, world? Uh, struggling musician, uh, 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 a person that loves music, and mm. but just didn't, uh, you know, hoping to find that, to hit that one gig that would set me off for, for life. But mm. it just didn't mm -hmm. happen. <coughs> For me that way, so from then on, I you know I started you know uh, acquiring all this stuff that are are toxic to the toxic yeah to your body. like an example. Can you give me an example? Alcohol, alcohol, green, drugs, self medicate. You know with you know try to is that medicate that? some issues that only God can mm. can fix. And I tried to, to fix, and of course uh, that led to one you know. One from to another. Mm. By the time uh, I realized that, I was, it, it was already too late. You know. Many things has gone wrong in your gone life. Wrong in my life, and there's no way to turn back and uh, redo. Mm. Only in Jesus, and so that's where you know I began to ask that question. Where I questioned my life, and of course, uh, suicidal side of thoughts and all. Suicidal that. thoughts. But, yeah, I couldn't do it on my own, bro. Mm. Just like you, I had to go places to find it and when you're desperate you do basically anything do you believe that many yeah. many people right now in our in our island right now are struggling so. with the, the so. same thing that you went through i believe so that's why i'm here bro you're here right now on this radio to right. to yeah. call all those these guys that yes. are guys and girls that are mm -hmm. that are out there that think that there's no any other way and there is a way right can you tell? Can you tell? Can you tell them? Jesus is the only way. Jesus is the only way. The way, the truth, <laughs> to the and joy. The life. Yeah. Yes. So, so, yeah. Uh, just I like what brother was saying. To the point where you're desperate, you have to find ways to get, you know, to to make it, to get out there because there's there's always a way. I, I got and a where question. There's a will. There's a way. Is that? There's a way. Mean? If there's, there's a will, will there's, there's a way. There's a way. And so, if you're desperate, find Jesus. Man. Find it's Jesus. The only way. Don't waste your time on any other places like I did. I went to look for love in all the wrong places. In the wrong places. Yeah. Let, let me ask you. Mm. So every time we listen to people uh, who have um, uh, see like uh, what do you call this uh, recordings and right. you know they sound so good on SoundCloud and right. on wherever mm -hmm. you know and you can hear that crisp like whatever that they're singing right. You mean at those times that you were recording where everybody was dancing to your music and stuff like that and right. loving you were suicidal? Right. It wasn't what I'm looking for. You were depressed? depressed. You were not happy? Not happy. How about now? Complete. Complete. Oh. Whole. Joy. Cold. Because <laughs> before I used to sing out of brokenness. Out of brokenness. So people say, oh, Gabriel, will eat man, I'm not want to eat them only. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I make fun because there was a friend of mine that 
said that to me. Malungi lak lem. That used to really matter to me. I went and I sang and I I I, I wanted to win their uh, attention. Yes. Their, their their win their heart. Their, their heart. Mm. But all those all those time I was just broken singing. Brokenness mm. just came out. And you know what's amazing? A person that knew me back then hears me now. And all they hear is this complete, restored, uh, full, uh, happy, overflowing, joy, overflowing, yes, person that you know the heart is singing now. You know, it's complete. Amen. And and, and and so there's a difference, you know. There's a difference. I'm I'm more alive than before. And the songs that I'm singing when I worship God, it's like medicine that cures mm, every, amen. every aspect of my life. You know. So amen. God uses it to. To uplift others while it it fixes me, bro. So so God is amazing. Yes, He is. And so that's why I'm here. It's for those who to literally have the uh, basically have that talent. You are chosen, bro. You are chosen. Do that, whoever you are. If you sing, you love music. You are chosen to worship God. And, and you were made for great things. Made for great things. Not just to throw it in the darkness and to the gutter and to whatever. This thing is precious. And it's, it, it's, it's for God first and foremost. And when you place God first, just as his word says, delight yourself in the Lord and he will give you the desires of your heart. I find that so very true, brother. And I want every single one of uh, a member of my family to come to that truth to be set free and, 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 and to realize that, you know, God is the source of life. And when you, Amen. Con when you connect with him, source. the word also says the fullness of who we are is in him. So if you're not connected to Jesus, you're barely scratching the surface, bro, of who you really are. So just get connected and, you know, just get crazy for you. What's Jesus. that? Hey, it says Things are going to open up for you. These rooms that are just flowing within me, I, I knew. I didn't know they existed. I'm approaching 60, bro. I feel like I'm still uh, 30, 30. 20. <laughs> I, I feel great. I'm, I'm alive. I'm more alive than any uh, any time, any age I've been. So, Amen. God is good and He's Amen. faithful Amen. and true. Amen. And he's got you, bro. So, a message to all the. Can you give a message to all those uh, people, real quick, before we yeah. we He's close out? All the out there. Stop all the musicians. Stop struggling. It's not about struggling musicians. That's and when you say struggling, that's a lie. Now, what's, when, you say, when you say struggling, what that do you they, mean by do they know? They know, they know what <laughs> struggling is, right? Trying to please yes. others, not God. There trying to yes. trying to win affection from people who are exactly. drunk. All and and about. and the thing about it is, uh, how can you sing to to people who are drinking if you're not drinking? You so it, it's exactly. it tends to to the point where you have to drink have to drink you have to drink right drunk mm. people so that you can sing to drunk people yes. right it, it doesn't. It doesn't. It doesn't, it doesn't add up. work when you're sober and you're trying to sing to a drug. Yeah, Don't or using work. drugs, or 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 trying to find love in all the wrong places. That's the there thing that go. we're. Yeah, right so, is. you know, <clears throat> wherever you are, and you and you have uh, and the struggle, just connect with Jesus. Connect with Jesus, and if you really wanna, uh, we we're gonna put this out so that people can know. Yeah. If you. If you want to learn more of and how to... And you go up there and you see us jamming... Uh, come. Island, That's exactly what I was about to say. Coruscant. Cor Coruscant, come. Come, come. come and sing a song with us. Okay, worship with us. Because we're going to be... Are. Come as you are. Yeah, yeah, so uh, yeah. before we close out, I'm going to sing one of these songs. But Amen. It's it's with a uh, 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 person singing. But here's the thing. Huh? Uh, uh, I, I can't find the instrumental part. but I, okay. I, This is one of my favorite songs. Right. And... Wherever you are, whatever you're doing, worship is a worship is a prayer form. Uh, worship form, is uh, in, form, in song form. In song form. Yeah. Form. Yeah. So, mm -hmm. if you have depression, you have anxiety, you have suicidal thoughts, you have what else, brother? What what else? Uh, depression. Um, lonely, if, lonely. Lonely. If you feel worthless. Sick. If you're in a broken relationship. Yeah. If you're suicidal. If you're addicted to drugs, uh, ice. If, if, if you're seeking anxiety, love, come to Jesus. Scared, yeah, if you, all the things that you know that does not make you happy. Yes. Hey, Jesus close your eyes. Well, if you're driving, please don't close your eyes. <laughs> if you're driving, please uh, don't close your eyes. Okay? But we don't own rights to this this music, but we're going to so sing along. Okay? This is Lord, I, I need you. Lord, I come. 
I confess, bowing here, I find my rest. Hallelujah. Without you, I fall apart. You're the one hey, that guides my heart. Yes, Lord. Lord, I need you. Oh, I need you every hour. I need you, my one defense. Come on, stand up. Let's praise our Lord. Come on, get up. Oh God, how I need you. Hey, Jesus. Oh, Hallelujah. Your grace is more, grace is found, is where you are, where you are, Lord, Lord, I am free, holiness is Christ in me. My song to rise to you when temptation comes my I will call on the name of Jesus when I cannot stand I fall on you Jesus you're my hope and stay You're my righteousness, oh God, how I need you. I want defense, you're my righteousness, oh God, how I need you. I want defense, my righteousness. Let us pray. Heavenly Father, we come before you humbled. Lord, we not only pray for ourselves in this radio station, but we start with our president, Lord. We pray for him that he will be filled with your power, your might, and your discernment to be able to truly make decisions that will uplift our island and the people that are in it. Lord, we pray for the ministers for that. Whatever decisions that they make into the, the, the governmental areas that are uh, doing services, that it will always stay in righteousness and holiness in your ways, your truth, and your life. Father God, we pray for the delegates and the senators. Mm. We pray for the governors and the legislators. Yes. Father God, we pray yes. for the traditional leaders. We pray for every household that are led oh, by God, men, God. men of God and those who are struggling right now, that we pray for them to be able to stand yes. up yes. as Palauans, yes. to be able to truly set this land, yes. to be able to come free from the curses that our ancestors have made, yes. made it to happen, Lord. Mm. Father God, we ask for repentance. We ask for Hallelujah. forgiveness in the people that are, uh, all of us that are as Palauans, one united in, yes. in you, to be able to come to you, Lord, and ask for forgiveness. Leaders from the very presidential area all the way down to, to whichever, to each household that we're, we're being able to lead in your name, your truth, and your identity, Father God. Lord God, we pray for all the, the pastors and all the priests and all the, all the churches, Father God, that the Holy Spirit will be able to go through and be able to use them to be able to bring the fire of the heavenly God to be able to truly let lead the people to come into respect, honor, and loyalty to God the Father and for us to be able to share goodness of your fruits from the Holy Spirit into each and every individual so that we can lead our young generation to be able to come up and to be able to stand into 
step into their destiny, into their purpose, into their calling, Father God, because it is a calling. Yes. So, Father God, we are not all the same. We are one of a kind people. We are one of, one of a kind individuals. So, Father God, we pray. We pray for everybody, the elders and everybody, that mothers that are praying for their, their daughters and sons, mm -hmm. fathers yeah, that are doing right. the same, who yeah, are trying right. to lead their children, and also Stand teachers that them. they know what they're yeah, teaching, yeah. Father God, that these schools will bring in the godly, godly ways and for the Bible to be brought back into mm -hmm. and so that it can be shared in the public schools and also in the in the private schools father god we stand boldly before you in the throne of thrones knowing that where two or three are gathered in your name you are in our midst so father god we use we pray that this station will be blessed and to bring more worshipers to come here and to speak of testimonies from different churches and different pastors to bring their testimony so that people can truly know there's victory in the name of jesus and it is through the power of the holy spirit that leads us into the the way, the truth, and the life of the revelation of who Jesus is. So, Father God, we pray, and we thank you so much for this opportunity. And we pray for each in individual right now that they will truly be able to, to truly know that Jesus died for a very <clears throat> important mission from God that has been given to us as individuals, as a society and as a nation of yes. Palawans yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. to come truly to seek this relationship seek ye the kingdom of God and his righteousness and everything else will be added unto us so Father God bless the listeners bless the families and bless everybody bless our nation of Palau in the mighty name of Jesus and everybody say Amen, Amen. Amen. praise the Lord thank you so much and for everybody that is listening, we will be we will start having uh, one uh, one uh, talk show every month. Uh, uh, they're giving me they're gonna they're gonna give us a, a schedule, and hopefully, you know, we can make it a routine for mm. a set date every month. So we thank you, and God bless you, God keep love you, you, and God thank love you. you. Jesus be loves safe. you. Jesus God. loves you. Amen. 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 Wow. 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 Wow.